Hello everyone, uh, this is Li Hao. As you know, Einstein H2 is for good for human body scanning. And from this 1.3 version, uh, this one brand new thing we added is to support the our foot station, which is a pretty useful um, add-on to help you scan foot or other um, soft object which are hard to turn around um, easily. What it does is that uh, uh, we have this small stand which is both profitable and easy to use, uh, which contains a layer of glass and markers and another layer of uh, reflective mirrors on the bottom. This will help you to scan both top and bottom surface at the same time. And meanwhile, in our software, um, it's possible to help you to automatically stitch both sides together and give you a final uh, results uh, without any extra operation. So let's take a look of how this foot station works. To use the foot station, uh, we start with the white light mode. And after we start a new program group, foot skin. Now, you need to scan the foot station alignment under the align mode. After that, uh, you will be need the foot station marker file uh, to be loaded, which you can find by downloading it from the Shiny 3D Passport website. You can go to our Shiny 3D Passport website, log in your account, then bind the foot station with the serial number at the bottom of the foot station. Then you will be able to download the .p3 file. Now go back to the software. Here, you can click on this mark to import the configuration file. Locate the file you just downloaded, and then you can click on confirm to start. Now, uh, let's start with the left foot first. During the scanning, make sure you maintain a good scan distance. You can also change the brightness of the scan settings so that uh, you get the most of the data. If the customer wears white sock, you might need to lower the brightness in order to gain more data during the scanning. After you finish scanning, just click on Optimizing and Generate Point Cloud. There's no need to do extra operation to clean up the data. Now we can click on the bottom left to switch to the right foot. After you finish scanning the right foot, you can also click on Generating the Point Cloud. Then. Um, if you're satisfied with both of the foot scanning, we can click on the mesh uh, to go mesh the scan data. The workflow is just by one click and you don't need to do any setup. The software will automatically uh, stitch data together and clean up all the data and you will be getting uh, two foot at the same time.